everybody, it is I, Angel Star 291 here yet again, and this time with part 19 of my co-op Let's Play Paper Mario Thousand Year Door with Iron Pika the Pikachu. Introduce yourself. Hey. This is like the third part we're recording today, and we're having way too much fun. <laughs> we did part of... We recorded part 17, 18, and this is 19 now, so... Yay? <laughs> anyway, let's do the next match. Uh, let's get it on. Indeed, let's get it on. Nice impression, though. Ham a bam and flare. I want you. Can you please stop putting this freaking wall? My gosh. Oh my god. How many times have you got that done? I mean, How many times has that happened to you, Ness? By the way, uh, shout outs to Green Lightning Mr. T for doing the double pain run in this game too. He has commented on a few of my videos. So yeah, shout outs to you. You did inspire me to do this. You know who he is, right? <laughs> yeah, he knows who he is now too. Alright, just wanted to give shout outs. Um, Nothing wrong with that. Nope, and I do thank him very much. Um, and I do thank you. He's have com he has commented on a few of my videos. So uh, if you're watching this video, Green Lightning Mr. T, uh, hi and thank you for inspiring me on making me on making this LP happen. Well, co-op LP happen. And also, Double Pain sucks ass. Just saying. Anyway, let's fight these it guys. Really well, actually, let's not fight these guys for the first three turns because this is gonna suck. The reason why I wanted to give a shout out while the, while that was going on with the first three turns was because I thought I'd, I I just wanted to bring it up. Just thought, you know what I mean? <laughs> just you know, bring something up because I have nothing better. Well, so Actually, this might not be so bad. This one might not be so bad, because if I can't attack for the first three turns, that means I can just tattle for these three turns. Know what I mean? <laughs> this might not be so bad. That's a hammer, bro. You know him. He throws hammers, hence the name, blah, blah, blah. Max HP is 7, attack is 4, and defense is 1. When his HP drops and he thinks he's in trouble, he'll toss a hammer barrage. Nothing about these guys has changed. They're tough as ever, so brace yourself. Dang, this book always skips the important stuff. How do they carry endless hammers? Because they have it in their shells? I don't know. They are powerful, though. Uh, there is no logic with that one. They are strong, though. They are very powerful. And you can try super guarding them all you want. You won't give them any damage. That's a fire row. This is relative of the hammer, uh, of a, ha of the hammer brother spits out fire. Magic B is 7, attack is 3, and defense is 1. If you get hit by a fireball, you might catch on fire, so guard well, okay? When his HP gets low, he gets desperate and totally starts attacking like a fiend. I'm gonna keep on defending with Mario because I think that's a smart decision. Know what I mean? <laughs> Good Ow! Point. Now I'm burned. Oh shit. I know, I'm burned. My ass is on fire! My ass is on fire! And now it's and now it's copyrighted. <laughs> That's a boomerang, bro. This relative of the hammer bros prefers boomerangs. Imagine being a seven attack student defense is one. He attacks twice with his boomerangs on the way out and on the way back. When his HP starts getting low, he fights all the harder. Prepare for multiple attacks. Yeah, these things are dangerous, and this is kind of bad. I think I'll be okay, though. I think. That's... That's bad. Ow! Oh, um... Whoa. That makes things a lot worse. Oh! Death. Didn't mean to do that! I'm an idiot! <laughs> uh... Okay, this is bad. Really, really, really bad. Um... I think what I should... I'm not sure what to do, to be honest. I'm, I'm, I'm in a loophole. Help! PLEASE HELP! <laughs> wait, 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 wait! I got it, I got it! I know what to do! I know what to do! Was that a smart choice? Please tell me it was! I think so. Oh 
Oh, good. I'm. Oh, but I still take damage from the fire. That's just stupid. But I made a right decision. Thank goodness. My gosh. That was. Wait, that was no good. longer burn. And so that's good. Yes. But I made the right decision. I'm glad I made the right decision. You know what I mean? <laughs> but didn't do that, I would have been dead. Yeah. <laughs> but didn't do that, I would have been totally dead. <laughs> Don't you think? <laughs> yeah, no kidding. That was close. Like, really, really close. Don't you think? <laughs> I did that on purpose, by the way. Now, can you please stop putting the freaking rule of me having to fight the first three turns? Don't want to do that anymore. You know what I mean? Seriously, how many times is that? Oh yeah, if your partner goes out, if you have a live stream with you and your partner goes out, the live stream will go to them. So yeah, try not to let that happen. <laughs> Just <See> say. <laughs> that's that's kind of mean. Anyway, we got a new message. Let's see, is it from X again? Go to the telephone booth out on the pavilion, or pavilion, I'm not sure. Anyway, yeah, 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 we'll go to the pavilion. First, we gotta freaking heal Goombella, because Goombella has zero HP! <laughs> My god! I know that rule! I hate that rule I like here! I really hate that rule! Don't you agree? Uh, what? What are you- what? Gonzales! Good time, you pudgy little punk! Uncle Rockox got some advice for you. If you keep stealing the spotlight from me, you're gonna enter a world of hurt. Quit making such a splash for value, puny life. Har 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 What a creep. I know, right? <laughs> How dare you threaten us like that? Talk about low class. Wait, he threatened us. You think that hate mail came from old chicken legs? <laughs> no. <laughs> well, who knows? One thing's for sure, we gotta watch our step from here on out. <laughs> chicken legs. That was a good comeback. <laughs> I think you mean rooster legs, but okay. <laughs> or hawk legs. Gamela, come on! Oh, there you are, okay. <laughs> Anyway, let's go to the silly telepole. Hey, Bella got stuck. Yep, the Bella got stuck. Anyway, let's go to this silly telephone booth. By the way, I could use a few items since I'm running on empty on items right now. Sheesh. I want to get some items there. Yeah. Oh, super mushroom. Definitely going for this. Know what I mean? I could use a few. Yeah. Maybe three. Yeah. I think I think three might do good for now. Know what I mean? Well, wait, what items do I have saved with this guy? I, I forgot. I can't, it's been a while, like I said. Uh, with Straw, what do I got? Uh, oh yeah, the Ultra Shroom, but that'd be really stupid for me to use an Ultra Shroom here. Know what I mean? I mean I'll take this Mushroom. I don't need a Mushroom anyway. Know what I mean? Why would you use it? Need, why would you use that right now? I know, right? Hello there, you customer. Yeah, 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 we'll buy a hot dog, because why the hell not? I thought there was an ice cream thing here, but oh well. Anyway, a telephone booth is over here, and what the heck is that? It's a storage key. Hello? No, we don't deliver. What? Uh, okay. Uh, go to the storage room next to Grubba's office from X. Storage room in the arena now? Sheesh, what next? This guy's got us running all over. It's driving me totally nuts. It's driving you totally nuts, then why are you well, with us? Well, we the exercise. You know what? You do not want to do it? Fine. We'll send someone else to come with us. You happy now, Gumbella? Sheesh. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> Complain much? I know, right? More like she's being bitchy. <laughs> Got her bitch foo on. <laughs> that was hilarious! Bitch foo. <laughs> That was funny. You made me smack my knee because it was so funny. <laughs> what? 
So you're telling me that you have no idea who got inside? What do we pay you for? I'm awful sorry, Miss Jolene. I heard a noise in there, but I couldn't find nothing. Hmm, fine. Leave the rest of this matter to me. Go back to your post. And listen to me carefully. Do not ever tell anyone of this or I'll have your job. Well, that was weird. You, Shimata, this is highly inappropriate. What business do you have here? Please, I must ask you to stay out of places where you have no business being. Um, okay. This sounds weird, but I guess this is the door that they're talking about, right? So, check it out. Never weird moment happened. I know, right? I'm just moving the mouse real quick. Anyway, let's go in here, because apparently we have to. Oh, what? Oh, it's you again! Oh! <laughs> we meet again, you husky mustache hunk, you! What, what are you doing here? What? Oh, Miss Mouse, uh, hi there, are you stealing something again? How exciting for you! Hey, by the way, a security guard heard you in here. Were you making noise? Oh, please, no one heard me! I'm the best mouse burglar of all time! I'm silent! Quite obvious that someone else must have been monkeying about in here. I, I, maybe, I'm not sure. Oh, sure, right, of course. That sounded a, a bit sarcastic, just saying. I didn't mean to doubt you, Miss Mouse. Hush, all you need know, to know is I've taken what I needed and now I'll be on my way. Uh, also, Coops, don't compliment her, just saying. As for the rest, help yourself to whatever you like. I know, right? <laughs> and now we must part again, my sweet mustache man. Oh, Mario, you lucky dog, you. I almost forgot my kitty. <laughs> Miss Serena holds many secrets, you know. You should be ca very careful lest you end up like those poor souls upstairs. And with what, 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 what? And with that, goodbye, my delectable hunk of cheese. We shall meet again. What did you just say just now? What did you just say? Boy, Miss Mouse sure is cute. Too bad I sound like such a dork whenever I talk to her. Hey, I'm a geek. <laughs> hey, but enough of that. What was that last thing she said about people upstairs? Yeah, why did why, why did she say that? Find the staircase switch to reach the attic. Find a switch case. It's been a while since I did this part. Yep, yeah, kind of thought so. Um, I just took a I just took a wild guess there. <laughs> Seems legit. I know, right? And then what you have to do is you gotta blow these things, which you don't really expect to do this. It's weird, you know what I mean? You don't expect to do this at all, it's weird. Yeah. But anyway, here's a badge. Another charge partner badge. If I have two of those, I'm probably gonna throw some of them away. You know what I mean? <laughs> Sounds good. Anyway, you don't you don't even know you have to do this. You really don't know, but that's what you have to do. You have to use Flurry's ability and do that. It's stupid. Gotta press the switch and Wow, how would you how would you even know I know, right? Here do I hear the here are the stairs that you have to go to. And free shine sprite, gimme. Anyway, nothing up here. There's something that door is locked. I don't think we can get into that late yet, but we'll probably get into that door sooner or later, right? <laughs> anyway, you know what you have to do here, right? Oh. I apparently can't press buttons. Ain't that right? <laughs> Look, another badge. An H plus for a partner badge. Is that what it is? Yes, it is. I don't, really use, I don't really use those badges much, but oh well. Are we in a bunch of sewers or something? Or is this an attic thing? Whoa, whoa, what? Yeah, what, what? What, 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 what's this? What? Look, look, look. <laughs> look, 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 look. <laughs> so you didn't find hide or hair of nobody in the storage room. That what you're saying? Yes, Mr. Grubba, it appeared to be secure. Don't worry about it, sir. I've taken the necessary precautions. It was most likely just a rat or something. Well, no big deal either way. Ain't nothing in there we miss too much anyway. Thanks for staying on top of this, Jolene. Hey, on by the way, any word on King K? You mean that k yellow Koopa? I'm afraid we still don't know the whereabouts of King K, Mr. Grubba. And so I deleted his spot on our roster per regulations. The Clisket no longer has any official connection to KPP, a.k.a. King K. Well, that's his name. I have, of course, taken the same steps with all fighters who have gone missing. 
Ooh, fighters have sure been going missing a lot lately. That's the fifth this year. Wait, fifth? Huh? Why tornadoes is going on? I heard, I even heard some security at Idjit saying the pit's, the pit's cursed. Sounds creepy. I doubt that, sir, but I certainly don't understand the certain disappearances. Well, for the time being, tell the other fellows that King K headed on home for a spell. If word gets out about missing fighters, it sure ain't gonna be good for business, no siree. Nasty rumors have a way of sending folks running to the hills, know what I mean? I understand completely, Mr. Grubba. I'll take care of everything, sir. Something's wrong here, just saying. You know, Jolene, you're a dang fine manager, but you just plum disappear sometimes. I gotta know, where in the world do you go, darling? Uh, the, that's... Mr. Grubba, I know you're my, you're my boss, but I don't believe that's any of your business. Easy, didn't mean to pry now. How about this then? Heard of a crystal star? Uh, what, 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 what we just see? Did you just see that? Pika, did you just see that? Yep, saw that. No, I've never heard of such a thing, Mr. Grubba. Oh. Stuttering? You're lying. You're lying! Okie doke. Well, I appreciate your time, Miss Jolene. You go ahead and run along now, you hear? She lied! I saw it! Well, if this ain't a fine how-do-you-do, seems like good fighters are a dying breed. That wild child Gonzalez is just about the only dry still guy around here. Wild well, Gonzalez, whoa, did you hear that? Fighters are going missing, dude. That ain't cool. Was that guy talking about King K, the minor league, minor leaguer? I thought he retired. <laughs> what in the A? Thanks, Seelan is spooking me. Hey, somebody up there? <laughs> Belt. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Burp. <laughs> Woo, Nelly. Just a little burping beetle. Here I am, thinking someone's up there peeping. Gotta relax, take some yoga classes or something. Yep, well, back to the ring. <laughs> Squeak, belch, meow. <laughs> I, would um, like to, I would like to do uh, a meow one. Whoa, whoa, man, uh, we dodged a bullet there. Hey, but did you hear that cry, that guy uh, blab blabbing about the crystal star? That Jolene lady acted pretty guilty when he let that one slip out. Well, whatever, for now we better bail before somebody finds us up here. Uh, sure. Can we? Oh yeah, if we, if we press that down there, it'll just say we can find something. But no, if we follow, it just leads us down here. I think there's something else here too, but I'm not sure. I think you can blow some of these posters, but I'm not 100% sure about that. You know what I mean? But oh well, I'm not 100% sure, it was just a guess. Anyway, let's go back to the to the major league room because there's nothing else we can do. All right. <sighs> okay, so there's a lot of shit going on, as you can tell. <laughs> I'm trying to see if maybe there's something out, something in these lockers. You know what I mean? Maybe there's. I don't think there's anything. Oh, there's an ice storm in there. Okay, I'll take it. Anything in here? I got locked in. No, let me out. <laughs> Sheesh. You can't see, right, Pika? <laughs> Pika? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> uh, sorry, I got an unexpected phone call. Oh, unexpected phone call. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'll cut that out if it's necessary. That's, That's okay, it's no problem. Well, I was trying to say, like, I think I have a phone call. No, uh, it's okay, don't worry, so I just didn't know. Also, you press this bathroom, it says, uh, occupied. Uh, okay, someone's head must have fell down the toilet, okay. Uh, seems legit. Alright, next match, let's see what we got. Uh, Crawd Daddy, rank three. Oh, we're getting close. Less than five turns? Okay, we just gotta finish this fight quickly. Which is extremely possible. Know what I mean? <laughs> but I'm not gonna lie. This enemy here is a little bit tough. That's pretty rough. Well, this enemy 
here is pretty tough, so I'm gonna have to go with a bunch of power bounces, and I can't use Goombella, which is gonna be really bad. But I don't think we'll have too much trouble. At least, I don't think so. Alright. Foolish morals, I will drag you through the gates of another world. Whoa, you got a dark mind, man. <laughs> this looks like that Gus guy we fought in part two. Know what I mean? <laughs> Except way darker yeah. and way creepier. This thing is a dark craw. Yikes, what a ghastly looking spear thrower. Magic B is 20, attack is 6, and defense is 0. Wow, that's some serious attack power. It is very powerful. You don't want to jump that. on it. If its spear is pointing up, cause that, cause that would hurt. It would. For a run of the mill spear tosser, he sure looks like he's got a point to make. So to let you know, you get hurt by that with Mario, and it's gonna hurt. And I mean, it's gonna hurt. Know what I mean? You do not want to get hit. You're gonna take 12 damage. Ow! Piece of shit! Did that thing just throw a dick move at you? Uh, yeah! It did! Uh... Um... Okay, I I'm gonna have to be careful, okay? <laughs> this this thing just threw a dick move. You are right, it did. Okay, it's only been two turns. We're okay, we're okay, alright? Ow! Alright, we're okay, we're still okay, alright? <laughs> ah, I gotta stop hitting the wrong thing. Okay. We are still okay, though. We're doing okay. Uh-oh, that's not good. Okay. Never mind. We're, we're okay. We're okay. Never mind. Uh, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to protect Mario a lot more now. <laughs> know what I mean? <laughs> Gotta get rid of this you thing. Need to be careful. I will be care. I will. Okay, that's three turns now. Ow! Dick move, piece of shit. Okay, we did it in four turns. We're fine. Alright? <laughs> and guess what? Cool. Level up, baby! And now you know what we're leveling, leveling up, right? HP for the win, bitch. Correct. Cause I did. Now we're a B-list star. So now our crowd goes from 50 to 100, which is great. That actually helps us increase even more star power, which is great. Know what I mean? Yeah, that really will help. The more star power, the better. I'm not complaining at all here. Up. Oh. Let's see what else. This is your last warning. Stop snooping around about the crystal star. If you don't, you'll suffer the same fate as the others who have gone missing. This totally... Okay, this guy again. He really seems to know a whole lot of stuff. Those missing fighters, a crystal star. You know, if we find this guy, we'll have all the answers. But who could it be? It's just some guy just being an asshole. I think. He's just trying to threaten us. But we're not going to be afraid of this threat. Next fight is with the Chomp Country. I want you to win before you take 20 HP of pain. Ooh. With... That's not really good with double pain, but I'll have to try. Know what I mean? <laughs> oh, what? Oh. Pardon me, Mr. Gonzalez. Another gift arrived from one of your admirers. I'll just leave it over here if that's okay. Do with it what you will. That cake looks a little different than the last time, and I don't have time, and I'm already fully healed, so why should I eat it? Know what I mean? I mean, I don't really have to eat it, I'm fully healed. Know what I mean? So why worry about it? Know what I mean? Anyway, cutting back in 
And sorry about that. Uh, apparently my internet cut off. So yeah, that sucks. But anyway, we're back here again, and we're gonna fight the Chomp Country. And what we, what I gotta do is, I have to beat him before I take 20 HP or less. Understand? Which is actually kind of tough with yeah. double paint on. But hey, we'll try. Know what I mean? Yeah, that's kind of. <laughs> I mean, they are tricky. They are very tricky. That's a red chomp. It's a rabid red biting, chewing, jumping fool. <laughs> Imagine being a tick, so attack is five and defense is three. Its attacks are so powerful, we could be in a world of hurt if we don't beat it fast. Which is why it re it's really, really lame that its defense is so high. Its HP is pretty low though, so items and special moves might just work. Just look at that color. Think someone painted it after it fell asleep at a party? Sounds like he got drunk or something. Don't you think? <laughs> the, that seems legit. Yep, seems totally legit. Painting of Tom Red after party. Totally does not scream a drunk joke right there. I swear, that screams a drunk joke. It really does. Okay, that last one, I thought I was going to screw it up. But no, we did it right. We did just fine. Also, look at the animation of how their things bounce in the air. But yes, these things are dangerous. Destroy them as fast as you can. But no, we did it right. I did it right. All right? Awesome. Looks like you didn't take any damage either. Nope, that's the point. I had to do this before taking 20 damage, so I did fine. Also, sorry for asking, but I didn't eat the cake, so... Hey, Mario, you see what happened to our pal here? Blur, body, went, numb, stupid, cake, hate, cake, never, eat, cake, again. Anyway, uh... Oh my gosh, that cake must have totally been poisoned! Boy, if we'd eaten it, that, that'd be us on the floor! Uh, oh. Uh, okay, here's what happens. If you actually eat the cake, do decide to eat the cake, uh... Your partner becomes unavailable to fight, and you will have to fight alone. Yeah, not a very good idea. Know what I mean? <laughs> that... That would be terrible. I know, right? The Koopinator, ranked one. I want you to appeal to the crowd at least three times. Not the worst thing in the world, but all right, fine. We'll do it. Sheesh, pain in the ass. Right? <laughs> that is a pain in the butt. That is a pain in the butt. We'll do it. It's fine. We'll do it. Sheesh. You're kind of like that crawd daddy guy. Oh, yeah. And you're that same guy from the Major League room. And aren't you the guy that fought Rock Hawk, like, right, be right before we actually started entering the these battles? Just saying. Was isn't that at the beginning of chapter, uh... Three? Yes. That's the beginning of the... Chapter three? Uh, yes. Yeah. That's a dark Koopa patrol. These guys just totally ooze toughness, don't you think? Magic V is 25, attack is 5, and defense is 2. Eee. After a charge with all power, its next attack will be devastating. Try to survive it. It's almost like those red eyes are there to warn you just how tough it is. Or maybe it just doesn't get much sleep. Alright, oh, bloodshot. I get it. Since I can't fight and I gotta peel, I have no choice. Good thing I did that on time, because if I didn't, that would have been really bad. You know that, right? <laughs> I'm so glad I got that super guard, because if I didn't, that would have hurt both. You know that, right? <laughs> yeah, okay, no I'm kidding. actually doing the super guard pretty well. Alright, I already, I already appealed three times, so... Let's kick some ass. Yep. I think piercing blow will be just fine, to be honest. Cause if I if I oh, I forgot to do the stylish. Cause if I use if I use a uh, power smash, it has two defense, so it would it would do the same damage. Know what I mean? 
That makes sense, right? Uh, yeah, I see. And I'm just gonna be... Yeah, I see what you mean. I'm just gonna be safe. Hey, it makes sense. Better safe than sorry. Exactly. Man, I'm going to super guard right here. At least it's... Okay. So that's the first time I've ever gotten a bingo on something. That one's a star one, so what it'll do is it'll raise the crowd to 100, and it will also uh, get your star power to fully, but really, I'm, I'm going to save this for the next fight, okay? I'm going to save star power for the next fight, alright? Got my reasons, alright? Um, um, yeah. Ow! <laughs> that was pretty painful. <laughs> Okay, but I'm still doing fine. I'm doing fine. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm doing a lot better, actually, than I thought I would. Yeah, I... Uh, <laughs> That'll heal Koops. It won't heal me, because I'm already at 100... I'm already at 25 HP. But hey, it'll heal Koops, so I guess that's pretty good, I guess. <laughs> Man, yeah. I'm getting that timing pretty well. And because I are lazy as a piece of shit. <laughs> Cause you know I'm lazy. And there, we did it just right. I'm not gonna lie, I think I did pretty well. <laughs> Do you think? Do you think I did well? And now it, I'm, I'm still here. And now I'm first place in the major league. I am kick ass. Another mail. Let's see what it is. Remove the great gun sauce. What? Why would you want us to do that? Yay! We have, to, we have to peel some Gonzalez posters. Why? Is it because you hate us and you just want us to get rid of those posters? You think that's why? <laughs> why, are there posters of us everywhere or something? Mm, I think... Why are there posters of us everywhere? Why are there posters of us everywhere? But alright, you want us to peel them off? Fine. Sheesh. Piece of shit. Yeah, this is what you gotta do. I guess we just gotta peel them off. Cause, I don't know, seems legit. <laughs> That's a big poster. I don't want to peel the big poster. I really don't, but it seems like we have to. Wait, what? A key? Whatever could that key be for? Go to the second floor. What? You mean that door we couldn't open? Okay. Sure. Why not? Right? <laughs> I know, right? I mean, sure. We'll go to that room, even though it says that we shouldn't go up there again, but alright. So yeah, that guy will move every time you try to go to the Major League, so yeah. Let's go unlock that door. Oh, and Flurry, I don't want you here. <laughs> All right, so let's open this frickin' door. Do I want to go in? I don't know if I should. Weird block, but all right. Whoa, what? Whoa! You gotta be kidding me! Baby Andy and King Kate, whoa, what? What? What happened to you, King K? Sheesh. Benny Andy? Gun, gun, Gonzalez, listen to me. Uh, man, don't get near the ring when no one is around. Uh, come on, shake it off, buddy. What do you mean, don't go near the ring? I, I don't think I'm gonna make 
it. Uh, what? Wait, what? Gonzalez, you see that? That was Jolene. This is craziness. This Holy is going mother of God. What the hell is going on here? What the hell just happened? My reaction right now. What the hell just happened? Also, I'm not Marge Simpson. I just kind of changed my voice for a second. Anyway, we're gonna end things off here. So next time in Let's Play, let's call it Play Paper Mario Thousand Year Door, we'll be taking on, I guess, whatever, whatever just happened just now and try to process it. This has been Angel Star 291 and. Iron Pika. Saying goodbye and see you guys in part 20. See ya.